Hello friends, it's Rahul and welcome back to the channel only for automation. So now today I'm going to explain a method which is very important on point on interview point of view, like a reverse string. But it's not a simple reverse string because interviewer ask a very tricky question uh, on the reverse also. So let me show you what is the uh, what is the way to reverse it. So like we have a string, a string str. Now we have a string with multiple characters like. Uh, this is sample text okay now uh, expected string should be like this like uh, exp str and uh, uh, now let me explain uh, what should be the reverse order like uh, we have uh, this this has uh, four characters and text is also four characters so it should be like text means we have to consider uh, character length also so now this this has two characters and we need to reverse sample but the proper uh, proper character count so like sa and the sample has five uh, six characters so it should be six like m p l e i s okay so it's reversed now this this is uh, this uh, has four characters so it should be this so the expected string should be like this you can see so this is uh, I have faced many interview and uh, many interviewer ask this question so let me show you how to create how to create this method so first uh, like uh, many interviewer ask uh, to explain verbally and many asked to write a code so if uh, someone asks to uh, describe uh, sometimes interviewer ask you to explain this method uh, verbally or uh, sometimes uh, ask to write code so if uh, uh, want to explain verbally then you just need to explain that first we reverse the string it means the whole string and uh, then we we start the uh, loop from uh, like 0 to length of the string and inside uh, another loop we also uh, create one more uh, one more loop and for this we start 0 to uh, again length and in that we reverse the character means not a whole string but we reverse the character and rearrange by using uh, the length of the our actual uh, string let me show you in a, in a clips okay so here uh, now we have a string like a string str and this is sample text okay now uh, okay I'm going to create a method public uh, static void and uh, like reverse with uh, arrangement okay so here create a passing argument which is a string str okay okay now first need to split the string so we have a method which is a split so a split return multiple multiple uh, set of strings okay so we have to uh, we have to create uh, array of uh, array of string okay so a variable of array type so it will return a array so like a string okay and uh, like just create uh, okay as equal to str dot simple method which is a split you can see in a pop-up okay str we have okay that's fine so here string split we are splitting the string basis on the space so we have a space like this space is so it will uh, it will split and store all the characters in uh, s so like we have multiple strings now 
this is uh, another string which is on uh, zero index and uh, is is on one index okay so like that so now i'm creating one more uh, variable a string uh, reverse rev okay and just passing a blank uh, thing okay so here first i'm going to reverse the string okay so it's very simple to reverse without using reverse keyword like integer i equal to s dot length minus one and i greater than equal to zero and i minus minus so here i'm putting length minus one y because uh, like we have a length of 10 but the index value is from zero to nine so length so like it will start from nine okay so we have a reverse equal to reverse plus s of i okay or we can do one more to prioritize this thing just plus equal to okay like uh, okay so now we have a reverse string let me show you rev okay let me execute this s of uh, we have a s of i it is working or not let me check again So let me show you how to execute it. Uh, first, we need to call this method over here. Reverse. Okay, now we have str. Let me execute. Okay, so now we have text sample is this. Okay, so we have a reverse string, but without any space. Okay, so now let me rearrange this on the our actual script on the basis of the count of the actual sprint okay so here i'm creating one more uh, loop i equal to zero and uh, i less than s dot length and i plus plus now guys we have a reverse string we just need to rearrange we just need to arrange this sprint on the basis on of the count of this string okay so need to convert this string into character so character array c equal to s dot s of i so okay so we have a string as of i dot to care array so it will convert uh, convert a string to character array okay so it's not a reversed it's a length of our actual string okay and we are converting a uh, character to that actual string means this we have a this now we are converting this to character okay so now we have a t h i s n c okay now i'm creating one more uh, loop which is integer j equal to zero and uh, j less than c dot plan okay and j plus plus And now just print reverse dot care at uh, i and j let me so like we have to create one more uh, iterator one more variable to iterate this thing like integer k equal to zero okay 
so here also uh, increment this uh, variable so like k plus plus and then and here we don't uh, we don't want to put uh, another condition this condition is uh, for uh, uh, sufficient for uh, this method okay so like k at of k okay and just print space to get the actual output okay now our method is done need to call okay we have already uh, calling this method just right click run okay so here just print ln need to replace this ln so it will print in uh, single line okay text so now you can see the output which is uh, sorry which is a uh, uh, text s a m uh, m p l e i s and is so it's like re rearranging the reverse the string with the um, number of counts character counts okay so i hope you like this video so please subscribe the channel thank you for watching in the next video i will explain how to uh, remove the duplicate uh, character in a string okay so thank you guys thank you so much